Hi, Luke. Hi. <laughs> I'm just going to be picking your brain by asking you some questions um, because we're going to be writing like a funny, silly story together. Just whatever comes to your mind, really. Like maybe the first thing that comes to your mind, just go with it. And I will move you along and ask you questions as we chat. Okay? Well, I have like three favorite foods. My first favorite is pizza. My second favorite is pasta. And my third favorite is probably like burgers or hot dogs. If you were to go somewhere um, in your neighborhood, where would that be? Probably to one of my friend's house. What's your friend's name? Um, my friend's name is Logan and he doesn't live too far away from me. Let's say um, you're at Logan's house, okay? And Logan is not home you are outside of logan's house if there's something outside of the house so it could be something completely different than logan's actual house then what would his house look like and then what would we do he would have like a magical flying train that goes all the way around his house and he has like a park in the backyard but the slide is super big that you actually have to go and hold something and then it takes you all the way up to the top of the slide and then you can slide down into the water. So you slide through the water and then it takes you out of the water and then you land in a sand pit. In a sand pit. Let's say we started digging in the sand. What would we find in the sand? Diamonds and you would find a couple of dinosaur bones. What? I'd be really, really excited because I've actually never seen a real dinosaur bone. Well, I have a museum, but to dig one up would be like so cool. I'd so, go to the museum and like show the people there that I found one. Mix and mash, a wing and a flash. What are your three words for the mashup mixer, Luke? Pizza, train, and dinosaur. Our adventure awaits. Mix and mash, and away to fly. gonna get up there. <gasps> this must be a flying train. We just need to find a launching pad. Will that big hill do the trick? Full speed ahead. Uh, I think the hill is waking up. Also, I don't think it's a hill at all. Wow, it's a dinosaur. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> Uh-oh. Better set a new course. Close call. Uh, it's not done playing with its food. Look! There's a cave up ahead. Our hungry friend won't be able to fit inside. Lead the way! At this rate, we'll never get to Cloud Nine Station. Huh? Huh? You smell pizza? Mmm. It's coming from back there. My first customers ever. Oh, welcome to my pizza stand. What can I get you? Aha! I think I know how to solve our hungry dinosaur problem. We'll take 400 large vegetarian pizzas, please. Coming right up! So we're just going to breeze over the fact that a talking bear is making pizza? Okie dokie. Oh, no, no. <laughs> He's definitely not hungry anymore. Your plan worked, Luke. <laughs> Looks like our grateful friend wants to return the favor. Get ready for a liftoff. <sighs> up, up, and away. Next stop, Cloud Nine Station. 
mix and match, I win in a flash. We going on an adventure. Imagine all the magic in the mashup mixer. Mix and match, a win in a flash. Mix and match, a win in a flash. Hi, Luke. Hi. How are you? I'm really good. Good. I'm really excited. Are you excited? This is your big day. This is when you're going to see your episode of Giselle's Mashup Adventures. <laughs> I am just so excited right now. <laughs> this is a lot of fun. I'm, I'm really excited that we're going to do the big reveal of your episode where you, we've taken your ideas that we chatted about. Remember we had that funny chat and I was asking you, asking you all these funny questions and then <laughs> take those ideas and then yeah, we put them into the mashup mixer and we go on an adventure all based on your ideas. So I'm really excited to show you your episode. So you ready? <laughs> yeah. Okay, let's watch it. What are your three words for the mashup mixer, Luke? Pizza. Train. Our adventure awaits! Mix and match, and away to fly! Ah! Oh. Woo! Woo! All apart! The Giselle and Luke Express! Next stop, Cloud Nine! Cloud Nine? Where is that? Wait, there it is, up in the sky! Uh, how are we gonna get up there? <gasps> This must be a flying train! We just need to find a launching pad. Will that big hill do the trick? Full speed ahead! Uh, I think the hill is waking up. Also, I don't think it's a hill at all. Wow! It's a dinosaur! <laughs> I wasn't expecting that! <laughs> Uh-oh! Better set a new course! <laughs> Oh, uh, it's not done playing with its food. Look! There's a cave up ahead. Our hungry friend won't be able to fit inside. Lead the way! Oh. At this rate, we'll never get to Cloud Nine Station. Huh? Huh? You smell pizza? Mmm. It's coming from back there. My first customers ever! Oh, welcome to my pizza stand! What can I get you? Aha! I think I know how to solve our hungry dinosaur problem. We'll take 400 large vegetarian pizzas, please. I remember when I suggested that. The vegetarian pizzas. The that a talking bear is making pizza? Okie dokie! Oh, no, no. He's definitely not hungry anymore. Your plan worked, Luke. <laughs> Looks like our grateful friend wants to return the favor. Get ready for liftoff. <sighs> up, up, and away. Next stop, Cloud Nine Station. <laughs> Mix and match, a win in a flash. We going on an adventure. Whoa, that was so cool. <laughs> Oh, what did you think? How did, did did you like your little your little cartoon character? You your little animated. That was <laughs> amazing. You look great. Did you think you look great? Yeah. <laughs> and you sound great. Thank you. Oh, uh, it's such it's such a fun episode. I love it. Did you have um a favorite part of the episode? Yeah, definitely. My favorite part was probably when I asked for four hundred vegetarian pizzas. Yeah. You're gonna, yeah, you'll need like 400 pizzas to fill that massive dinosaur yeah. up, right? But I love that you said that it wasn't just any kind of pizza, it was vegetarian pizza, and there it is right in the episode, right? That <laughs> yeah. is so cool. Any other surprises um, for you? Like, did you try to imagine how it's all gonna come together with your words? Did you actually try to think of stories? It's <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And that was way better than I thought it would be. Like, yeah, fun, right? Yeah. The adventure just gets very wild, but your ideas were wild. Thank you. 
Do you remember, do you remember saying all of your ideas when we had the chat? A hundred percent. It's a great episode. I'm so happy and thankful that we were able to work together and yeah. you took part of it. And then you came up with this, these great ideas for the story. That's all you. So yay. Yay you, Luke. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Oh, well, big congratulations. Thank you. You too. <laughs> Thank you.